Today, I want to tell you what the most important part of church and going there to worship is. Let's talk about it. going on Closer to God Ministries, welcome back to another Righteous Spirit Food episode. Today I hope to help you get closer to the truth, closer to the kingdom, and closer to the will of God. Hallelujah, amen. We got to give him all the glory, all the praise, all the honor, because he is truly deserving. Man, people in their lifetime will go to church for different reasons and for their own interests. And I'll tell you today that when you go to church, it's important to know what is the most important part of the worship service. A lot of times people think I'm gonna just go because the praise and worship is good. Maybe they have a good choir, they have a good band, the music is upbeat and we feel something you know, arising in us, but when it gets to the message, we're like womp womp. Oftentimes we don't like the message delivered in church because it seems offensive, it seems abrasive, it seems disrespectful. But today I wanna tell you the most important part of worship is the message because the, the praise and worship, the music, the ambiance that you see, you know, as part of the structure of the church you may go to is nothing more than something to stir up the atmosphere for the message, to get everybody in the mode of being joyful, being happy, getting their minds focused on Jesus. But oftentimes when we hear the message that's, you know, delivered via this, comes from this, this is when people get offended. People feel like they're disrespected why people don't want to leave the church. I feel like the pastor, the preacher, the minister, whatever you want to call it, is talking about me. But when you go to church, the reason the message is so important because this is the meat and the potatoes right here. The music is nothing more than the milk. The music is nothing more than a snack. Sometimes people go to church looking around to gossip, to stir up drama, all kind of stuff, but really each and every one of us that's in attendance to church, we're there for the message. And the message that offends you because you take a stance in being offended, oftentimes is the message that you really need to, you really need to take in for your heart because it'll cause you to grow. See, most people, you know, have a, a practice of going to church to have their ears tickled and they want to hear what sounds good. They want to laugh. They want to be smiling. They want to be joyful. But everything outlined in here is going to let you know that we're all far from perfect and we all have some work to do. Most importantly, in order for you to understand that the message is the most important part of the worship service, your heart has to have a genuine desire to be in receiving mode in order to receive the message. Because if the door to your heart is closed, you're not going to be receiving anything. If anything, you're going to be giving more gossip, more foolishness, more negativity instead of focusing on God, what you're there to do. Oftentimes during praise and worship, everybody's upbeat, clapping, dancing, everybody's feeling good. But when the message comes out, this is when people start dozing off. And this is because they don't have a genuine desire to actually be receiving the word of God and actually to change their life and want to learn what they're gonna have to do in order to live according to the will of the Father, move according to the Holy Spirit, and the list goes on. Never forget the most important part of worship and going to church is the message. Don't forget to comment, like, subscribe. Check out the link in the description because I'm only shooting it gun barrel straight. Bow.